were recruiting Nuno in the summer, we had done an in-home visit. We felt pretty good about our chances to get him, but you know, every coach in the country was recruiting him, being a top 40 junior in the world. We get the commit from him, and he comes in, and he's the nicest guy. I mean, he's such a team guy. He's so humble. He's a yes sir, no sir type of guy. And that's when we saw like we had a special guy here. You know, and we can really help him mature on the court. I met Matt on uh, European Championships in the summer. I was in Cluster, Switzerland, and I was playing for Portugal. And he was there. He was not just recruiting me, he was watching everyone play. And I remember as a, I don't know, I got a little intimidated by Matt, just the way he looks, you know, first impression. But uh, it's been way better than I expected. I think the first couple months were always tough for adaptation, but uh, after that, it was, it's been really great. You watch him walk or jog, and you're like, this guy, he can't be number three in the country. He's, he's not even that athletic. But you see him hold that racket, you see him start moving on the court, and he glides, he's so smooth. He was born to play tennis and, and born to compete. We're playing South Carolina. He's playing a very good player at number one. And this is the SEC tournament. And he's played this guy before, so he knows this guy's a machine. He's, he makes a million balls, right? Nuno loses the first set. He wins the second set. And the guy goes and takes an injury timeout. And Nuno is at the back fence, waiting for him to come back from the injury timeout. And he's just pumping himself up, just talking to himself. And he starts saying, it doesn't matter what this guy's gonna do in the bathroom. There's no way he can come back and beat me. And he's just pumping himself up. And like me and our, our athletic trainer and our manager, we're just sitting there like, this is amazing. And so it's just moments like that where if he makes that decision to be a tough and a machine, no one can beat him. There's no secret, it's just working hard. I mean, Matt helped me a lot develop all this time. Working on the right things, having the right mindset, and wanting to do more. I think that's, that's the basics. He's so talented, he's going to be able to step up after college and acclimate to that level that's top 200, 300 at ATP. So we want him to go for it, um, but we don't think about that too much or focus too much on that. We're more here in the moment, whatever we need to do that week to help Nuno and to help his development, we're focused on that. All my success is due to all the work and all the team work we've done. It's not just me. and. Besides, I mean, we've been doing pretty great as a team as well. It's not just me. I'm, and they're a big part of what I've, what I've become.